something extraordinary is happening in Japan. While most countries are still trying to make their trains a little faster, Japan quietly built machines that float above the ground, slice through air, and move so fast even airplanes are starting to look slow. These aren't ordinary trains. They're precision-crafted rockets disguised as passenger transport, fusing science, art, and obsession into one unstoppable motion. Every curve, every magnet, every whisper of wind has been engineered to perfection. But here's the real question. How did Japan do it? How did a nation known for silence and discipline create technology that literally bends the rules of physics while keeping the calm efficiency it's famous for? And just how far can they push before the rails, the air, or even the laws of nature themselves start to break? Today, we're diving into the five fastest trains of Japan, masterpieces that prove this country isn't just building transportation, they're building time machines on rails. Stay until number one, because what you'll see there will completely redefine your idea of fast. Number five, Shinkansen E6, the quiet lightning. Meet Japan's crimson streak, the Shinkansen E6, slicing through mountains and tunnels like a whisper at 320 kilometers per hour. Designed for the rugged Akita and Tohoku lines, it's not just fast, it's precise. Its nose stretches nearly 13 meters long, sculpted like a bird's beak to silence the thunder of tunnel booms. Engineers obsessed over millimeters to make it glide smoother, quieter, calmer. This train doesn't just move, it meditates at 300 kilometers per hour. What's wild? It couples with the E5 to form a twin bullet beast, synchronized like a pair of samurai cutting through air. The E6 proves that Japan doesn't chase speed recklessly, it masters it with elegance. Number four, Shinkansen N700S, the smartest train alive. They call it the Supreme, and it earns the name. The N700S isn't just another Shinkansen. It's the evolution of everything Japan has learned in six decades of high-speed rail. Launched in 2020, it runs between Tokyo and Osaka at 285 kilometers per hour. But the true magic hides beneath the body. Its silicon carbide semiconductors make it lighter and cooler the nose reshaped to slice air like a blade, and the train can literally diagnose the tracks as it moves, replacing Japan's legendary Dr. Yellow. Inside, every vibration is absorbed, every sound dampened. You can sip tea while racing past cars doing 100 kilometers per hour as if they're frozen in time. It's not just fast, it's self-aware. The N700S is like the Sigma of trains. Calm, confident, unstoppable. Number three, Shinkansen E5, the precision monster. This is the train you can actually ride today, and it's still setting the standard for the rest of the world. The E5 series, also known as the Hayabusa, hits 320 kmph between Tokyo and Northern Japan. Its nose, 15 meters long, looks like something NASA would test in a wind tunnel. And that's not an exaggeration. It reduces drag so perfectly that even at full throttle, it barely trembles. But the real aura here, reliability. The E5 has been running for over a decade with near zero delays. It's so precise that its average annual delay is measured in seconds. When Japan exports train tech like to India's bullet line, they start with the E5, because this machine is the blueprint of perfection on rails. Number two, Alpha X, the prototype that bends air. If the E5 is precision, the Alpha X is pure experimentation. This prototype from JR East isn't here to follow rules, it's here to rewrite them. During test runs, it reached 400 kilometers per hour, flirting with the limits of air resistance. 
Its nose is so long, it looks more like a missile than a train. But there is a reason for that. It's designed to bend air itself. Every surface adjusts to reduce shock waves and pressure as it enters tunnels. Onboard sensors track thousands of data points every second. Temperature, vibration, humidity, even micro air currents. This is a train that learns, a train that adapts. By 2030, the Alpha X is expected to enter service, cruising at speeds that would make airplanes rethink their job descriptions. It's the definition of futuristic, a glimpse of Japan's next quantum leap. Number one, L0 series maglev, the train that flies. And now the crown jewel, the L0 series maglev. No wheels, no friction, no limits. This isn't a train that rides the tracks, it floats above them levitated 10 centimeters in the air using superconducting magnets colder than outer space. During testing, it shattered all speed records, 603 kilometers per hour, the fastest any human has ever traveled on land. Inside its vacuum smooth guideway, there's no wind, no noise, no resistance, just motion, pure, unfiltered motion. When it enters service between Tokyo and Nagoya, passengers will cover what used to be a two-hour trip in just 40 minutes. It's not a train anymore. It's controlled flight sealed inside steel and silence. While the world debates the future of travel, Japan quietly built it. In a world where everyone is chasing speed, Japan turned it into art. From the quiet E6 gliding through forests to the levitating L0 that bends physics itself, these trains aren't just machines. They're proof that perfection isn't about going faster. It's about how gracefully you do it. So the next time someone says trains can't beat planes, remember Japan's answer floats, not runs. Which of these would you dare to ride first? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe for more stories from the future.